all so today we are going to construct development of a pentagonal prism okay first i'll be drawing the uh, top and front view uh, that is the orthographic of the pentagonal prism so first i'm constructing a pentagon of dimension 30 mm okay so then after that i'll be constructing the thin lines inside uh, uh, three perpendicular bisectors to get the center of the axis okay i'll be drawing three perpendicular bisectors here to get the center of the axis okay so i can mention the naming here a b c d e so we can give the naming here <coughs> mention as the top face center o and o1 okay so now we will be drawing the front view of this so axis length given in this problem it is 60 mm So I can draw an axis for 60 mm here. In all the vertical, because here uh, the front view of uh, a prism is a rectangular face. You can show the dimensions. So now we'll be extending this to get to draw the development of it. Two horizontal lines. Okay, now I'll draw one. Uh, okay, vertical edge for 60 mm. So this is we constructing using parallel line method. So now after this, I'll be have we have to draw five faces for a distance of 30 mm. So for this, I'll be using offset command. So giving the distance for 30 mm. And then by clicking, totally five faces have to get because it is in pentagonal prism. Okay. You can mention the namings: capital A, capital C, capital D, capital E, and again here. Okay. You can construct the bottom face and top face here. Can mention here for the top face A one capital in capital we should mention here for the development okay C one D one E one and E one okay so for the orthographic also I will be mentioning the namings okay for the top face and bottom face and for the front view I will be mentioning the naming. so that you can able to understand it is an prism okay it is having two faces top face and the bottom face top face notation it is a b c d e and bottom face notation it is a1 b1 c1 d1 and d1 and it is written within brackets in the same way we write for the front view Okay, same way we write for the bottom face also here. Okay, this is the basic problem uh, in uh, prism. So we know that uh, prism and uh, prism and cylinder will be projected using parallel line method. Okay, so this is what the parallel line method. 
of constructing a pentagonal prism here. I will show the total length here. So total length we get it here is 150 because 30 mm side with respect to the 5 faces 150. So this completes the problem. You can uh, subscribe for the channel and hit on the bell icon for the notifications and share it to the maximum students so they get benefited. Thank you all.